That's pretty cool. We were too late to come and see the concrete being laid. They're almost done now. I would have liked to be able to film it, but they're doing a good job. So they're almost done. A nice big truck. Is it D D C D concreting? I have to look them up. Concrete, and we didn't know, and they finished. Never mind. It's done. Woo, all the way up there. Hello, King of the Castle. You are. <laughs> On top of one thaggy, it's probably the biggest hill in the area. Oh, well, it's coming along. Not fast enough though, but they're getting stuff done. Dirt. Lots of dirt. up to you. Why not? You're in your own garage. That might be the, all, all the garage that we get with this blasted virus. <laughs> is this the garage? Yeah, that is the garage. That's Axel's man cave. It's very windy. Stabilization, sta stabilization holes. Ah, I know what they are. I saw another housing company do that. They got them in the house as well. Great whopping holes. Watch where you walk. Can't bring the doggies now. Might lose them. Everywhere. Lots of places to poop. <laughs> Gotta watch where I walk. Oh, that's good. Good that I see this. This is very good. Everywhere. Alright. Don't ask me where everything is. There's just a lot of pipes everywhere. I was sulking yesterday because I didn't think they did anything. But they did. They've been very busy. They dug holes. Support. Support. Cement holes. Which I'm very happy about that they did that. They did some more scraping of soil, making it all nice and level. And they put in a driveway, which is good because when we move in, it's just going to be mud. So at least we've got that to, to get from the road to the house. More dirt, piles of dirt everywhere. And they're not allowed to touch that. Hello. Hello. No touch my garden. I kill you. I won't kill you, but I'll do you some bodily harm. Rightio, that's the end. No idea why they do that. But, I'll film a little bit of it. Uh, 
I like the t-shirt. Don't know if you can read it. Yeah. Huh? Typical tradie world. Five months will be moved in. That sounds really good to me. Ooh. He's smiling. It's just good to see it all coming together, right? Doesn't do that often. <laughs> if you're walking on that, you won't even think about it. Think about you smiling. Right, ah. <laughs> oh dear. Oh well, we got a crushed rock driveway anyway. <laughs> Better than nothing. Right. I said I'm doing a movie. So we're in the spare room across from our room, which is the same size that our old bedroom used to be. 
It's not leaking, they just haven't finished uh, cladding outside yet. So this will be a nice view out here. Cupboard, which needs a bit of adjustment. That's our bedroom. It's very big. Probably could have had more wardrobes. We've only got one little one. But we don't have a lot of clothes. So we will get a couple of sets of drawers. Take care of that. Bathroom. Oop, very dark. That's the shower. It's quite big. There. A window. And the basin will go there. On that wall. A couple of cupboards and mirrors in there. And toilet, of course. Sliding doors everywhere. Bedroom. It's a sliding door. And our lovely window. And we can put a nice big cupboard of sorts there. We're in the passage. It's very dark at the moment, but there'll be skylights all along the roof along here. Uh, bathroom. Family bathroom, which I have a feeling I might spend a bit more time in because it actually has a tub that I can get in and out of. Whereas at the other house I couldn't I couldn't get into the thing and I couldn't get out of it. So it's gonna be nice. And a shower with a funny little soap shampoo nook. Yeah. I didn't get you. Mm -hmm. uh, cavity doors everywhere. Uh, we'll go into the lounge room. Boo. <laughs> We've got two big doors here. And hopefully the dogs won't pounce themselves on and the dogs will be destroy. Educated. Oh, they'll get re-educated, all right. And that's the fireplace over there. Echoey. Another two doors, three doors. Nice big room. Proper room with no rooms coming off it. More passage. And this is, what's this? Oh, this is the other bedroom. It's nice, nice big bedroom. And a passage. Oop, it's wobbly. Where are we going? We're going into the doggy's bedroom, which is also the laundry. Nice big room. That's the underground heating. And a cupboard will go there. Washing machine and double sinks. This massive door. Super sized wide door. Nothing on this wall except tiles. Where are we now? We're in the family room, which is not huge, it's big enough. And that'll be where the bench is, where that plumbing is sticking up. And the kitchen will go in that corner there. So the cooker will go here, I think. And this is where the fridges will go, freezers. Great whopping double doors there. I don't really know why we did that, but it's done now. And sunny dining room. This is going to be my favourite place in the house. With nice big views. And the patio long patio it's 
not finished yet. I still have to put the roof on. But it will be nice when that's done. Double sided fireplace. Let's see if we can get a picture of it. Nice big sliding door. It's coming into the lounge room from the family room. That's where the TV will go. TV and record player and whatever. And this is my fancy schmancy double fireplace. I like it. It's got nice logs. Now I'm going down the passage. Make sure I don't break my neck. That's part of the pantry room. You can't see much. It's a bit dark. Getting dark outside. Looking down the passage. Front door. Passage cupboard. Lovely door. It's going to be a nice door. Out to the garage. Big mess. That's all right. Garage. It's been getting rained in here. <laughs> and pantry room. It's very dark. But anyway, it's a big room. So. So the uh, oven will go there and the um, cooktop and a couple of light switches, sink, can't see it but it sinks there, windows, a bit more light. Back into the garage. Massive garage. Oh well, you might have to do some work from home, so it's got a nice place to do it. So this will be the kind of the front yard and you won't see this because two great whopping tanks, water tanks are gonna go there. And we'll have a fence here, keep the dogs in. Whoop. And down the end there, the end of the house, there'll be another fence. And a gate. Keep the puppies in. Let's do separate. Yeah, but now it's two videos. Anyway, the bricklayer came and he cleaned the bricks up. And they look really nice. I'm sort of glad they were darker. And they still go with all the other stuff. So they don't clash. Hey? Yeah, I want all the pellets. So that's the entryway. And this is the side of the garage. Yeah, I'm trying not to break my neck. So this will all be concrete here. And that will be our front door. And there will be a fence running from that post across over there, you can't see it now, it's too dark. We'll have a fence. Yeah, probably go across to that little shed over there. And this is our front door. Ugh, mud. We're gonna have a little fence across here. Keep the pictures in and so I'll escape. That's the dining room. No front door yet, but there will be a nice one I'm back in the passage. There's Axel, he's saving the pallets for me for our compost bin. Whoop. Careful! It's a sunny dining room. Dining room, we call it sunny dining room, and there will be a nice big wide path along here which I'm looking forward to and this is the other side of the patio so that's the 
patio there we go they've done everything up the top there they just have to get the sheets on and guttering yeah no guttering yet but that is going to be a really nice spot to sit dining room front door garage axle still moving pallets mud <laughs> lots of mud bricks lots of nice bricks they're spares. Oh, it's very dark. It gets dark real quick this time of year. Mud. It's going to be fun getting rid of that. And sewage. It's not finished yet. This is the laundry. Nice. And I totally didn't realise that we put cupboards in. So. I'm very happy. It's all been waterproofed. And the kitchen bench is in. It's huge. So, too bad we didn't have this when the kids were little. Oh, and they put the corner piece in. And the pantry doors are on. And it's a bit dark that the all the cupboards are in. We had to go for the, the flat sage laminate because they didn't do it in the vinyl wrap, but it looks alright. See if I can get a bit of light. There. It's gonna be a nice cozy room. And there's the seat. Window seat. Just have to get a cushion for it. Well, that's my kitchen. A skylight. There we go. Skylight. It's going to be nice. Bathroom. Cabinet. Oh, and I've got drawers. Lovely. You just forget the things you've ordered. So that's good. So the toilet will be there. These are the cabinets, window, nobody can see. Nice bathtub that I can actually get into. And the shower. Wow. Okay, no handles on yet, but we each have a set of drawers and we each have a cupboard. And I totally forgot that we had drawers. This is the ensuite. And then we have a cabinet each, one sink, we don't need two sinks, and lots of bench space. So, hang on. Go the other side. And that's the shower. It's going to have a, a seat. It's nice and big. And a little nook thingy. With shampoo. So it's going to be a nice bathroom, a toilet, where we can actually move. That's the bedroom. The bed will go there. That's my view. I'm going to get a tall boy on this wall. And another tall boy on that view. Oh, view on that wall. Because we don't have a walk-in robe. We only have this cupboard. So that should take care of our clothes. So I can't get over how nice this lounge room is going to be. This is five o'clock winter in July and we're still getting nice sunshine coming through. And even though we have this huge roof don't know if that's going to do a lot of good, but it'll keep us kind of dry. There's the pergola outside. It goes all the way down the side of the house. Still a bit of work to do. It's going to be a nice space though. And these are the drawers for the bench seat. 
and of course my second kitchen in the pantry room which I think is going to be really good so it's a nice big sink and I really love the cupboards oven will go there and all I need is handles so I'm glad we picked this um, wood look because it, it actually looks really nice so now I've got to decide where everything goes it's gonna fill up quick I think it's pretty big never big enough though yep and that massive garage <laughs> everybody's like it's huge and it is okay signing off now bye